So we were talking about these, uh, these networks and things like that. And this is just a, a kind of a, a mock example. Um, it was created with some uh, data from, from a client, but uh, I've, I've been changing it a bit. And these two people are actually characters from the social now event that you mentioned before. But uh, just basically here, this map was created to illustrate um, how people are connecting to each other in the organization. The, the, the answer that uh, was used to create this map was around people who inspire you. So in this case, what we see here is Anne McClear. She's actually a member of the, the, the management board, uh, but she's really new in the organization. And yet she's seen as someone who inspires her colleagues. Um, and uh, with the, the different colors, uh, the different um, co um, uh, colors in the circles are about their geography, so where people are. And she's actually in the UK, but yet she's an inspiration to colleagues in all other countries. Um, this person here is also seen as an inspiration, but is only inspiring people within his own region. So what these things allow you to do is really to get a sense of who can be used as a leader to inspire. But if this person wasn't a member of the board, you could actually use Anne McClear as someone who can facilitate a community of practice, who can be a champion of change, uh, who can actually um, help you spread the message, the culture, and the new ways of working that you want to push forward in the organization. Um, but, and this, as I mentioned, this map was created by asking people a question um, about who inspires them. But actually, you can take this information by looking at how people interact in social technologies. So you can create maps like this out of the way people interact uh, in your own social platforms. So if you control those social platforms too much, you actually don't have a way of looking or understanding and unveiling these kind of networks and patterns. So it's just, it, it's a very long-winded uh, answer, but to say that sometimes you need to control the conversation a bit but it's also very important to give space so that these people can can emerge. Um, and um, yeah, just out of curiosity. So this is just uh, the, the local map, um, or the, sorry, the, the global map. And here we can see how people are connected around topics. So these are the skills. So I can see who in the organization has uh, these kind of skills. Uh, I can see where they are in the world. Um, and again, this is something that you can do based on questions, uh, but also based on how people interact in, in different uh, tools. Yeah. So, sorry, I get excited about these things. I'm sorry. <laughs> 